You know, one of my coworkers keep mentioning how these lights, one is burnt out in this one, and one is burnt out in that one, and that he has to switch them because if he doesn't switch them and another one burns out, then it'll be super unsafe. And honestly, I did not notice for the longest time. <laughs> but then, you know, Saturday, I think it was Saturday, Monday maybe, I don't know. Last time I came into work, I came in to put the alarm code in and I completely missed the button and I was like, I was probably just because I'm tired. But today I am not tired. And I went to put in the alarm code and I was struggling to see the, um, the buttons and the numbers. And I realized it's probably, oh, bright. It's probably because of the lack of light in there. And so now I'm like, yes, please change those immediately. Although in all fairness, I think I only have like two shifts left. So it's not the end of the world for me. Anyways, at the theater, obviously. Woo. It is Wednesday. This is potentially like my third to last shift until I go away, which is very exciting. Um, although yesterday I got an advance for a show on Friday, which we didn't have before, so I might have to come in Saturday. I'm gonna think about it, play it by ear, see if I can let that rest until Monday maybe when I'm training and then get my trainee to do it. So more like reinforcement of this is how you do these things. So we will see for now though, I'm definitely working today and Friday and Monday, but I'm gonna go, I'm gonna have my lovely breakfast drink. Woohoo! And um, I don't think I have a ton to do today, which is kind of nice because it's the second Wednesday, which means my coworker will be in. So that's exciting. <laughs> I am home. <laughs> it is 2.30 and I can finally say that I had success with printing. Oh my God, why are these all scrunchy ones? <laughs> the rest of my labels. Very exciting, <laughs> literally basically out of ink as I got the last scrunchy ones done, but everything is printed. I had to redo them all again. We're finally there. I also made these little ones to cut for cards. They've got my Instagram and my Etsy store on there, even though my Etsy store is on vacation at the moment. Um, but yeah, it's very exciting. That's a huge thing I can check off my list. And I think now probably the plan going forward, I'm going to chill for a bit, I think, because... <sighs> Um, but I think the plan is going to be, I'm going to make my bed, probably vacuum the floor because I'm done sewing and it really needs it. Where can I, let me, let me put this here for a second. Maybe. <laughs> the surfaces, they are not the greatest. And then there's cords in the way. There we go. It's fine. Um, but I also got, I ordered some mask chains because in blind I don't know, like BC or like road to recovery or whatever the heck it is. Um, July 1st, theoretically masks are going to be optional, but I don't know if I'm still gonna have to wear them. So I want to get mask chains. So when I'm at work and nobody's in the store, I can just wear them down around my neck. And so I got this one, it's so adorable. Like it's so delicate and pretty. Ooh, ah. <laughs> the other one that I got is a bit sturdier than this one I would say um so I was really glad this one came because I started to panic because I'm like am I if I'm going in early is it going to come in time I don't know but it came which is very exciting so I will just put it in this little bag with the other one ba -doop, ba -doop. and we're good <laughs> and then I have like all over my room I have bins right down here of things I'm bringing, <laughs> but the plan today. So I think in an ideal world, I would make my bed, vacuum my room, do my laundry, and then just start to pull all the clothes that I wanna bring with me, bring my totes upstairs and just start tossing everything in. Ideal world. So we'll see how it goes. I don't work tomorrow, so that is nice. And um, I'm feeling pretty, pretty positive at this juncture. <laughs> it's the clothes I'm not as concerned about. It's it's the nitty gritty, the tech stuff and everything else that I'm like, I'm gonna forget something. I know I'm gonna forget something, but it is what it is. <laughs> My friend got his vaccine today. He says he's doing all right so far, his second dose, so that's good. Um, and as far as I know, we're, um, he'll, he's not going in before Monday, so fingers crossed. Also at work, I need it keys. I think I mentioned it and somebody is working on getting the keys so I can give my replacement keys. So 
that's a win. So today, overall positive. And I wasn't like dead tired when I went to work, despite, oh, I don't think I mentioned it. I woke up at 6.30 this morning because I had to pee and it's like the worst thing ever because I only had like another like 50 minutes of sleep. Okay, I'm rambling. I'm going to chill for a couple and then start doing stuff. <laughs> I'm just realizing how tired I look. Ah! Anyways, things are progressing. I downloaded a bunch more music from Artlist and I, I think I'm going to call it at that because I, I have a cap of 40 songs a day that I can download and I have 150 and so I think that's enough. Um, and, and if there's anything I'm seriously looking for while I'm out there, I would be able to download it. Just obviously not 40 songs, but I got <laughs> some more mail. So <sighs> I bought some stuff from Old Navy previously and then you get super cash. Let me adjust. And then when you get the super cash, they're like in a month you can spend it. And then you get like 16 emails. And so I bought more stuff. <laughs> but in all fairness, I really like like the pants I got. So I want to get more pants. And I found a dress that I think will be cute. I'm super into dresses right now because I am insecure about my body. <laughs> and so the dresses are great. Speaking of dresses, <laughs> I got the dress that I'm obsessed with in this sage green color. It's the exact same dress that I have in the floral print and in the orange, but in the size of the floral print one, because that one fits me better because I size down. Just obsessed. And also with this green color and it not being floral, I feel like it's more transitional for the seasons. <laughs> Next, I got these red pants. They are pixie pants. They are high-waisted and they are ankle length. Um, so something different. These are the same as the yellow ones that I got, except these ones are ankle length and I'm pretty sure the other ones aren't. They're nice and stretchy too, which is great because we love some stretch and I love Old Navy's pixie pants. I have since I started wearing them. Whoop. And then this one was kind of a gamble because I wasn't sure. Um, it's this cute little floral shirt it has the tie at the front and then it's got the um i don't even know what to call this like the elastic the scrunchy scrunch <laughs> i don't know at the back but it's super adorable thought i would give it a try to give me some cute shirts because i don't really have cute shirts i'm working on it next i got another dress <laughs> it's a different style than the other ones it's very similar but it's a lot shorter as you can see. It has a tie up at the front and it's got that same stretchy back material. So I'm very interested to see if this will fit and if it'll look cute and all that jazz. <laughs> and then last but not least, I picked up this boyfriend denim jacket, it oversized um, and also oversized um, <laughs> because I thought it'd be nice to have it. I don't know if I'll bring it up to my channel, but I've been looking for a denim jacket for a while to embroider on. Um, I just don't know what I'm going to embroider on it, but yeah, <laughs> I thought that would be cute. Like I said, I don't know if I'll bring it out, but I have it. So I'll try that stuff on later. Probably. I mean, I got to try it on before I pack it because if I don't love it, I'm not going to pack it, but that is where we're at. I have a vlog up ready to export or no to edit, which is from yesterday. It's amazing that I am this caught up on that and I have laundry in and once my laundry is done, I'll probably start doing the thing where I segregate the clothes that I want to bring versus the clothes I don't want to bring. And that way I will wear clothes that I'm not bringing so I don't have to do laundry again. I'll probably have to do laundry again, but maybe not. And so it begins. That's a disaster. I don't even think I have everything pulled clothes wise that I want to. Um, <laughs> but I reached out to my friend and I was like, hey, do you want to go spend a Starbucks gift card tomorrow? Because I got a Starbucks gift card. Um, 
from my mom's boyfriend the other day and he was like, well, I'm busy tomorrow, but do you want to go tonight? I'm free after eight. I was like, yeah, sure. So I had to get changed really quickly, but it was nice. We got to hang out, saw the um, guy doing the thing over the water. We couldn't remember what it's called. It's not paragliding, but motorized parasail. I don't know. Anyways, I think for the foreseeable future, it's currently 22.10. For the foreseeable future, I'm going to try to get everything that I want to take on that bed. And then I can start tossing things in the tote. I mean, I'll use the suction vacuum bags later, but step one, get everything out. So I know if I need to edit or not. Good morning. It is the next day. Last night, I think I just spent a lot of time clearing off my bed so I can sleep in it. So I've got this tote over here that is full of clothes. <laughs> Overflowing with clothes is more like it. I still have those bins up there. And then a bin there and that one mostly has food in it right now. And I think some shoes. It's already like 26 and a half degrees in my room today and it's only 11. So today is just going to be terrible. Is it even 11? Yeah, it's after 11. Um... Today is going to be terrible. It's going to suck, but I think what I really need to do today is I need to lay out all the clothes because even as I was throwing everything in last night, I was like, I don't need this many clothes. I haven't used the vacuum bags yet, so obviously I could fit more with the vacuum bags, but I was like, ah, I don't know if I love this because I just... No matter what, there are always pieces that I bring out that I wear once or not at all, <laughs> and so I want to try to avoid that. But, I mean, except the reality that there will probably be pieces that I'm like, yeah, I don't want to wear this. But we're going to try to minimize that. So I think that's going to be the plan for today. And um, other than that, I'm not really sure. I need to find my agenda. I don't know where it is. <laughs> and, get, and get looking. But I'm shopping today. Grocery shopping at, like, I think 5.30 or something tonight. Um... So that's a thing to look forward to. But for now, we got some time to putter, wake up. I'm going to go make myself some lunch. There's leftover tacos so, or taco meat, so I'm going to do something with that. But yeah, that's, that's, that's where the, 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 the good morning. I feel like I'm having a very lazy day today. I mean, I'm being productive, but like I had lunch probably almost three hours ago. <laughs> and all I've done is fold all those clothes and lay them on my bed. So basically the point I'm at is... I believe I have all the clothes that I want. I have a checklist over here to go through and um, I need to edit for sure. There's too much stuff over there. <laughs> I have like one, nine, wow, I cannot do math, nine. Yeah, I have like nine t-shirts. I guess it doesn't seem like too much, but I have like one, two, three, four, five sweatshirt. I don't know. There's definitely some stuff that I want to edit out of there. Um, but overall, I think I'm doing pretty all right. I, here's the problem. This is the exact problem. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six pajama shirts. I do not need six pajama shirts. I need like three pajama shirts. I need like one or two t-shirts, a tank top, and then maybe the long sleeve, except one of the sweaters I'm bringing will work well if it's a cold night to just throw on over top. So yeah, that's the situation. So I think the plan, I'm going to go have a snack because my mom and I are going to go out for dinner I think before we do the shopping which also like I, it's it's the list that I have on here which is massive um we're gonna go out for dinner before that but she's not off to like five and it's like quarter to three so I just want to have a quick snack there's some french bread downstairs that I hope is still good because you know french bread it like starts to get like really crusty so fingers crossed on that and then um continuing on that we're gonna start with the edit and then I will pull out the vacuum bags and that will be the next step. All right, so all my shoes and footwear are packed in there, save the Blundstones because I wear them out because they're the biggest. And over here, I have all my clothes packed, plus some scrunchies and masks because who knows what the mask situation is gonna be. I'm a little concerned. I feel like I might have to edit that a little bit more because that's like full and I only really have this and backpack space, so we'll see. Okay, it's like just about five o'clock. It is a brisk 26 degrees in here. It got down to like 25 and I was super jazzed and now it's just gone up. There was a nice breeze coming in the window, but we're making progress. There's um, still quite a bit of a mess. All the clothes are in there. I'm afraid I might have to go through it again because <laughs> I feel like last year I was able to get, I had less, I definitely had less clothes. Anyways, but <laughs> we'll probably edit that a bit, <laughs> but here we got the shoes in. Got my embroidery stuff, which I'll need to put in, at least some of it, in bags. And then 
the list. That's stuff that I have to ship off. That's my outfit that I'm going to wear day of, so that's exciting. <laughs> we got a mess over here, and I still have this bin here, and then food is in there. Also, before I forget, eh. <laughs> I want my drone. Oh, and there's also like other things I need from in there. <sighs> yeah, this will at least probably go in my backpack, but I keep forgetting that I want to bring it. So do, do, do. let's go back over here. <laughs> I want this for my G7X, and I need this for my GoPro, and I need that for my GoPro, and that, <laughs> and that, <laughs> I should have done this without anything in my hand, and that, is that it? I think that might be it. Oh, that's the back for the GoPro dive suit. Mm. I think I'm okay without it. Oh, propellers for the drone. <laughs> so yeah, still lots of stuff to try to get in. Like I said, most of my tech stuff I usually put in my backpack. Eh. Okay, keep going. Okay, I feel like it's super loud and windy in my room, but I am home. It is just about 8 30 i'm just about to sit down to do invoicing because it is thursday and we have to invoicing but grocery shopping is done save a few things i need to grab the last minute like some milk and bread and stuff and i i think got everything i needed except for allergy medicine because i need to go to the grocery or the drug store for that because they have the stuff i like better but yeah that's where we're at we got a mess still going on here um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to invoice and then I'm going to go downstairs and I am going to separate all the meat so I can start freezing it and then hopefully spend a little bit more time <laughs> with that. Time is ticking but also we, we got stuff. Also they didn't have the big conditioner pumps that I like so I bought like a bunch of small ones but I do still have a pump here so I might just fill it. We'll see. <laughs> it is so bad. <laughs> Okay, so those are going to be consumed before I go. And I'm sorry if it's loud because it's hot in here so the fan's on. But <laughs> I'm kind of at the stage where I'm starting to pack my toiletries, which there's some on here and there's some of these bags because I just bought it. And also tech, which there's some in there and then some over here still. Um, yeah, fun, 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 fun. Invoicing is done, but it's like 10 o'clock and I do have to work tomorrow, so... At some point in the near future, I should start um, clearing off the bed. <laughs> but I think before that, I'm gonna put on a show and then contemplate life. <laughs> there's just, I feel like there's just still so much. Like I still have a little bit of food downstairs. It's gonna be close. It's gonna be close. <laughs> I also, <laughs> and things that I didn't need to buy but wanted to, I bought these like <laughs> ivy lights to put up in my room because it's nice to have something fun. That's that's it. That's all. That's it. <laughs> okay, so it is the end of day one of packing. It's technically like on to day two because it's after midnight, but it's going all right. I'm going to have to go through my clothes, I think, because I think I just have too many and I am already running out of space. I still have this tote here <laughs> and then... The majority of that tote there. These are my clothes that I'm gonna wear out. And then this isn't all the way full, I just jammed stuff in there. So we will have to see, but yeah, it's getting pretty full. I did, however, get most of my toiletries packed. It's nothing exciting. Uh, shampoo, conditioner, razor, deodorant. <laughs> I don't know, just, just typical stuff that I would use. We do have that kind of stuff in the store, but I like specific stuff, so I bring my own out and then worst case scenario if I run out then we're all good. I'll just buy something there or get something sent in. I'm also washing my makeup brushes <laughs> before I go out which I normally wouldn't do <laughs> because I because of COVID I haven't worn makeup for like a very long time because <laughs> I just don't go anywhere and they were dusty. <laughs> it was real bad but yeah so I will check in hopefully tomorrow with uh, day number two of packing. Oh and I also like got all my 
most of my meat and everything that I bought separate it, like the beef and the, the I gotta do the chicken still, but that's a, that's another aspect and it's pretty boring, but it was something that needed to get done. So we are making strides, <laughs> but I just, I just feel like I have too much stuff and I always feel like that. And then whenever I get out there, I'm always like, I don't have enough. So it's a balance. Alrighty. So it is the end of the night. Oh, well, it's like quarter to one. I am tired, kind of. I'm very hot. It's 28 degrees in my room, which is really unacceptable for one in the morning. Like, who does that? Oh, my laptop's being a jerk again. You know how it's like kept turning itself off? Well, it's doing it again, and I don't understand why. Like, I updated it, and it was fine for like two seconds. Anyways, uh, packing is going pretty well, other than my melting now. Um, I, I still have two bins about this size <laughs> that I need to get in to a space that is not that large. <laughs> um, but we'll see because I have pulled out my um, backpack and I can definitely get, I think my backpack's like a 40 liter backpack so I can get quite a bit of stuff into there. And the really cool thing about it is it's like a backpacking backpack. Ta-da! Oh yes, it is 40 liters. But the neat thing about it is it's got a U-shaped zipper so it zips all the way down here and all the way around like a suitcase, which makes it easier to fill. But anyways, this is the damage at the moment. That stuff I have to pack up to mail or to drop off. I've got the scrunchie tags on that tray too that I need to find somewhere to put. And then in my bag to bring to work tomorrow, I have the other tags I need to cut after work. So that's where we're at. I'm sweating to death. I am dying, but I'm gonna end the vlog here and I will see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye.